Hey guys, welcome to the most ridiculous version of the vehicle of the week we've ever done. This is a 1994 Unimog with a full camper on the back. Let's get right, into guys. it. So it is a diesel, uh, mechanically super sound. We actually flew one of our buddies out uh, west to drive 1,500 miles back on a pretty epic road trip in this thing. Tops out in the high 60s. Uh, no air gear. There is air in the back though. It's all a stick shift air brakes kind of like a semi things just fun so welcome to the deck uh, we'll get inside in a second a uh, little bit of backstory on this thing it's been out west for quite some time we're in Kentucky so pretty long trip to get it here and this unit is actually already sold we never even got to list it a friend of ours picked it up so it is four-wheel drive the previous owner put brand new tires on it so you're not going to get stuck for those of you all not familiar with Unimogs they're huge over in Europe which is where this car actually came from uh, and they're basically tanks, right? They're kind of like the Hummer over there. They'll go anywhere, do anything, put anything on the back of them. Vehicles, uh, they're pretty iconic all across the pond. Uh, this particular one has some interesting story to it. So it definitely has gone Burning Man, so it's seen a lot of life. And supposedly, it actually made an appearance in the Jurassic Park games. So welcome to the interior, guys. So it's got a full kitchen, dual burner stove. You do have two propane tanks mounted under the vehicle. Uh, this lifts up and is a full uh, fridge and freezer and then obviously you pick up uh, a regular sink too. Plenty of overhead storage. Coming to the other side of the cabin you have a full shower uh, as well as a toilet. Moving back this way uh, you have a couple seats for uh, dinner and that is your dining room table. Obviously pretty big queen size mattress which is great AC unit there's actually quite a few plugs in here um, pointing to a few of them that you're probably not going to be able to pick up but it's wired for anything you want it to do and then it's on a dual battery system so this is the whole electrical panel it's set up like I said just like a boat um, it does have a solar panel up top to work in conjunction with those so you can work just off solar it charges the batteries uh, it's bomb proof guys if the zombie apocalypse happens this is your bug out vehicle for sure. That's it for us here at Cross today. Make sure you hit the subscribe button below. If you need anything in the future, please feel free to give us a shout anytime at 502-459-9900. We'll see you guys soon.